Alright, so what the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take a little container and I'm using a tint pool and a tint brush um, just so I can, because this is what I have laying around, but you guys can take a, a plate and whatever, you know, and just buy a brush, they're like a dollar at Sally's and pour a little bit of conditioner, it does not matter what conditioner it is um, I'm using like, I don't even know what it is, it's just some cheap conditioner get it in there, just like that then what you're going to do is you're going to take the extension and I also place this extension kind of far away because it's kind of simulating that it's grown out a little so yeah then take your brush and apply a little bit of conditioner and the camera might move a little it's, I just noticed that it's moving apply a little bit of conditioner right here as you see I'm applying a little try to get it as close as right there as you can so it'll kind of slide down on the glue then take the other side of your little um, brush and try to make sure that you're only lifting the extension as much as you can and if you can't get it too close to the ex to the um, extension then you know just pick some out you gotta do what you gotta do what you want to do whatever just lift it up just like that see how I'm lifting it up and you can kind of see where the glue is attached to the hair lift it up and apply glue there I mean apply conditioner there do that let that fall down do the other one now lift it up and keep doing that so you can either leave this in for 30 to for 30 to minutes to an hour I like to do an hour just so that, that there's not that much tangling and don't start pulling right away I just did but slightly go back and just apply a little bit more conditioner and just let it slide let it hold it for a couple minutes um, 20 to 30 check it in like 20 to 30 minutes to see how fast it's sliding off and then if it's still pulling a lot of hair or whatever wait an hour wait 30 more minutes and then pull it off so I'm gonna let this sit for about 30 to 40, 30 to 40 minutes and then I'll be back to show you what to do. all right so now it's been about 30 to 40 minutes so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna try to get a couple sections of the extension here I don't know if you guys can see this or not and slightly sl like pull slide down see how I'm pulling it and it might pull out a few strands of hair you know, that's always gonna happen but it's the easiest way to remove the extensions without getting like super extension like rip out see how it just let them all out like it literally look you can kind of see right there there's, it came out like nothing most of the glue came out too and that honestly is the best way that I know of <clears throat> to remove the extensions there's hardly any of the hair on here and this should work for you too so let me know how this goal works for you um, do a video leave me a comment rate it tell me how you feel about it from a one to a five star let me know if you guys like this and I will be doing how to remove the individual bonded hair extensions so stay tuned for that and um, don't forget to subscribe to my new channel